Hi everybody, I'm Howie Mandel, this is Bobby Jenerick, and welcome to Bobby's World. What's my line? What? Welcome to Bobby's World. Oh, I'm sorry. Well, we've got a great show for you today. That's my line! What? We have a great show for you today. Okay, Mr. Smarty Pants, you tell me what to do. Uh, dance for the people. Bobby Han, why don't you go out and play in that backyard until I finish feeding your gee golly little brothers there now yet? Oh, right. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I told yeah. him I should meet you, losers. Oh, yes. Okay, Mom. Come on, Roger. Let's go play with Derek. <laughs> Two, three, four, five. You flip six of them. Hey, Derek, what are you doing? Can I play? Go away, dweeb. This is just for me and my friends. I could be a friend. No, you can't. You're my brother. Now get lost. I'm in my own yard. How can I get lost? Go fly a kite, Bobby. I don't have a kite. Take a long walk off a short pier. I can't. I'm not allowed to cross the street. Then just go climb a tree. That's what I like about Big Brothers. They have so many great ideas. You can't see. What are they doing? Thanks a lot, Dweeb. You've just ruined the best Caps game of my life. Wow, Caps! That sounds like fun! I want to play, too. Can I play catch with you, Derek? Can I? Can I? No way! You don't know the first thing about playing this game. Oh, yeah? I do, too. I know the first thing, and the last thing, and all the things in between. Do not. Do, too. Do not. Do, too. Do, too. Do, too. Did you ever notice that the less you know how to do something, the more you have to say you do? Okay, shrimp. Prove it! Well, uh, you pick up the ball. There's no ball. It's a slammer, dweeb! I wasn't finished yet, okay? You pick up the slammer, and you, uh... You don't even know that you use the slammer to hit the caps, do you? I was gonna say that next! See? I do, too, know how to play. <laughs> <laughs> Forget it, Bobby. Come back when you're big enough to play with something besides your food. <laughs> oh, Derek! Lucky! I've got all your caps. You 
give me back those caps now, dweeb. Those are my special collection of sacred ancient caps. Wow, secret agent caps. <laughs> The name is Bond. Bobby Bond. Well, it looks like the Slaminator has found me. Hold it right there! These are my special caps. I don't want your tweeb cooties on them. Bobby's got tweeb cooties. Bobby's got tweeb cooties. Bobby's got tweeb cooties. Bobby's got tweeb cooties. Yeah? Well, well, who wants to play with you guys anyway? <laughs> Freeze, Dweeb! Uh-oh. Let's see you do that again. Okay. Whoa. Ah! Uh-oh. Am I in trouble? In trouble? In trouble? No. I hate to say it, Dweeb, but that was a great shot. You're a champion. Uh, I am? Yeah, you're a natural. I'm a natural? Come on, Bobby, fire it in there. It's slamming time. <laughs> Okay, Shrimp, listen up. From here on out, I'm gonna be nice to you because you're good at caps, and that could pay off big time for me. In fact, I'm gonna be so nice to you that I'm gonna be your manager. Gee, thanks, Derek. I don't know what a manager is, but I think I'm gonna like it. All right, step right up this way. Who wants to take on my super slamming little brother? I got to admit it, Dweeb. You're the Prince of Caps. Now nah, forget it. You're not the prince. I'm not? No, you're the king. I'm the king. I'm not the prince. Ladies and gentlemen, please put your hands together for the boy formerly known as Prince. Yo! You know, once I was the prince. But blah, 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 baby. Now, don't you know? Yeah! Damn. Now I'm the king. You're the greatest. You're the best there ever was, Squirt. And you're the best big brother manager that a little brother ever had. And I still don't know what a manager is, but Derek's the best. Which reminds me, this is for you. Ten caps. But what about the rest? The rest is our steak. As manager, I get all the steak caps. Understand? No. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, then from here on out, we'll split everything. 90% for me, 10% for you. Fair enough? Sounds fair. It's the least I can do. After all, you and I are best friends now. Yeah, best friends. There really is no other like my big brother. Him and me will always be a pal to one another. I used to feel rejected, now I get respected. Derek, he's 
he's my best friend. The baby is no other like his big brother. It's plain to see that him and me were made for one another. It's truly undisputed. It's so nice, nice to be included. Derek, he's your best friend. He'll take me everywhere he goes. To the mall, the rides, and the big kid shows. And say my name! There really is no other like his big brother. It's plain to see that him and he were made for one another. It's really no illusion. There's only one conclusion. Derek, he's your best friend. It's truly undisputed. So nice to be included. Derek, he's your best friend. Oh, pinch me. I must be dreaming. Well, gotta go, Bobby. You stay here and practice. We've got a lot of games to win, bro. I'm having a terrific day, Roger. I'm a champ, I have ten caps of my very own, and Derek just called me a bro. Isn't that great? <laughs> Let's go tell Jackie. Hi, Bobby. Wanna play caps? I don't know. Come on, Bobby. It's just a friendly game. Okay, but I thought I'd warn you. I'm a natural. I'm a natural too, but I've been practicing five hours a day, Bobby. My mother says that talent is 90% perspiration and 10% deodorant. Sorry, Bobby. Just wasn't your game. Like my mother says. Jackie, you and your mother are as if you watch too much television. I've lost all my caps. Now I'm not the champ, and Derek's not gonna wanna be my best friend anymore. What am I gonna do? <laughs> That's right, Roger. Derek has plenty of caps. I'll borrow some of his and win back the ones I just lost. And I'll be a champion again, and Derek will still be my best friend. Uh-oh, Roger. Kelly and Mom are watching TV. You've got to get past them and get into Derek's room without them seeing me. Like, that cat burglar is totally fine. Whoa, gee golly, Panky Derbs, he's coming down that ceiling like a spider, don't you know? Yeah, just like a spider. The burglar alarm hasn't been made that can't be cracked by Bobby the Spider Bandit. Webley, I owe you one. <laughs> Shh, Roger. We don't want anybody to know we're in here. We gotta make a clean getaway. I see you're back, Bobby. Well, sorry, Jackie. I'm gonna have to win back all my caps. Okay, sure. Losers first. <laughs> Too bad, Bobby. Now remember, what I'm about to do has nothing to do with our relationship. It's just a game. Oh, no! If Derek finds out I lost all his caps, he won't be friends with me for the rest of my life. Maybe even longer. Cheer up, Bobby. There's always another game. As a matter of fact, my mother saw one advertised on TV. A big tournament this weekend. You could... That's it! We'll enter the tournament, win back all of Derek's caps, and we can still be best friends! I'll be the champ again, you'll see. I've got to start training for that big tournament so I can win back all of Derek's caps. I can help. I'll be your trainer. My mom saw a whole show on personal trainers to the stars. Usually the place they start is with liposuction. Hmm. Super personal trainers. Welcome to my superhero training camp, Bobby. Get set for the 50,000 yard dash! <laughs> and you call yourself a superhero? You can't even outrun a speeding bullet! 
Drop and give me 20,000. Why am I doing this? I'm only going to play Caps, not be a superhero. But, but, but what if I don't win the tournament, Jackie? What if Derek finds out the truth? I've got to practice. Family secrets come out sooner or later, usually between three and four on Oprah. Everyone cries and yells, but sometimes you get a movie deal out of it. If I don't win as many caps back as I borrow from Derek, he won't ever be my best friend again. <coughs> and Mom and Dad will be mad at me. <coughs> uh, and Kelly will think I'm bad for taking Derek's stuff without permission. Oh. If I lose, Jackie, it's going to be awful. No one will like me, and I'll be all alone in the world. I don't need them. I don't need anything. Except Webley. I don't need anything in the whole world except Webley. And Teddy Bear. Yeah, that's all I need. Webley, Teddy Bear, and my hockey stick. And a mask is all I need in the whole world. And my favorite dust ball. I need that. And this! I can't do without this. Whatever this is. Hey, that's mine. Get a grip, Bobby. I wish I could be sure I was going to win that tournament! There are no guarantees in life, Bobby. Except on infomercials, of course. Jackie is starting to scare me. The truth is your only friend, Bobby. Tell your parents your story. If you explain the whole thing to them, they'll probably understand. They'll respect you because you told the truth. Yes! And Mom and Dad will probably want to give me a reward for telling the truth! Mom! Mom! I've got to tell you well, something! Well, rein it in. Rein, rein it in. Just a gee golly card playing moment there, young man. Can't you see that your father and I are playing cards with the hole is there now? Yeah. Queen of Trumps, I win. Thank you very much, Martha. Oh, Howard! We're down a thousand points! Now, honey, what did you want to tell Mom Mom? Well, Derek wouldn't let me play caps. Then he discovered I'm a natural, and then I wasn't a king or a prince or even a natural, and I lost all the caps, so I borrowed Derek's, but I lost them too. And, 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 and if I don't win them back, Derek's not going to be my best friend anymore. Now, Bobby, it was wrong of you to take Derek's things without his permission. I know. But don't you want to give me a reward for telling the truth? Now, listen here, Mr. Manzi. <clears throat> telling the gosh golly truth is its own reward, and it does not excuse stealing, don't you know? You're going to have to pay Derek back for every cap you lost. Yeah, and I want you to march up to Derek's room right now and apologize to him. Okay. Yeah, and let that be a lesson to you, hon. Gambling just doesn't pay, don't you know? Howard, don't be a cheese log. Annie up. This is our chance to win our gee golly steak back. Sometimes parents can be very confusing people. I hope Derek's not too mad at me, because when he's mad, he's like a monster. Don't leave. Stay and have a bite to eat. I'm having lunch with the boy who stole my caps. Say, wasn't that you? <laughs> it was almost worth losing all my caps so I could have such a delicious snack. Hey, Dweeb, throw me the ball. Derek? I gotta, I gotta, I gotta tell you something. Okay, hurry up, I'm busy. Borrow your caps and then I'll ask them, but I'll pay you back, I really will, I just don't know how. I'm sorry, Derek. We can still be friends, can we? Uh, we might be able to work something out. First, swear that you'll never ever take anything from my room without asking me first. I swear. Now we can talk about how you're gonna pay me back. Yeah, okay, I wanna pay you back. I'm going to give you anything of mine that you want. Anything! Okay, I'll just take your hockey card collection. Not my hockey card collection. You said anything. Okay, anything. But my hockey card collection. Then I want your stamp collection. No! Not my stamp collection! Anything! But my hockey card collection and my stamp collection. No! 
That's my lucky yo-yo! Not -yo. anything! But my hockey glove gloves and my stamp collection or my yo-yo! Anything! 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 It's mine! It's mine! You said it was mine, weeb! Are we still best friends? Just don't be stupid! We're brothers! You're eating up my yo-yo right now! Mom! Mary took my stuff! Mom! Mom! Ladies and gentlemen, let's put our hands together for our special guest tonight, Fabio! Of course? <laughs> hey, thank you for having me on the show. I can't wait to see it. But it's already over. Oh, okay. Bye! Bye! I'm almost ready to power up! What's going on here? <laughs> Bobby, maybe you should spend some time with your father.